Hey everyone, in this video we are going to hunt for open redirection vulnerability in live websites. So let's get started. So this is the target URL or the target domain. So here is the target domain and we have to hunt for uh, open redirection vulnerability over here. So uh, the first thing that you should do in order to uh, hunt for open vulnerability is that you have to uh, collect all the parameters that this particular URL have. So there are many ways to do it. The most common way to do it is to uh, just dock, dock it with the particular domain on the Google or you can just brute force the particular directories or you can also use Paramspider or Arjun in order to find hidden parameters. So we are going to use the first step in this particular video in which we are going to just uh, Google dock this particular domain for uh, hidden URLs or the hidden parameters that are going us to redirect to some other websites so let me show you what i mean by that so i'm just going to copy this and let me remove it and i'm going to type site and here i'm going to type in url so we are looking for parameters in the url that should be something like return url so we know that return url is a special parameter that allows someone to rewrite to one web uh, one page to other page right so this is why we are looking for return URL over here. So I'm just going to hit enter. And perfect. As you can see, we got some hidden URLs from the Google Doc. So let us open any one of these. So I'm just going to open this. Let's wait for a few seconds. And here is the site. Let me see if my website is working or not. So it's working. And now. As you can see, this is the return URL parameter and the value is section streaming media item.php and strm media id, right? So what does this mean? It simply means that whenever someone tries to log in and if the password is right, then they are going to redirect it to this particular uh, location, to this particular uh, directory, right? So in order to test for uh, open redirection, we need to remove all of these and we are going to just type google.com and hit enter now as you can see we are not redirected yet but once if i type my credentials so i have already registered to this particular uh, url so particular domain so i'm just going to type my credential and let's see what happens so click on login Let's wait for a few seconds and as you can see we are redirected to google.com which means that this particular parameter or this particular url was vulnerable to open redirection vulnerability so i hope you understand that how we can find open redirection vulnerability on live websites so this is the part one of this particular video we are going to uh, make more series on this particular uh, open redirection vulnerabilities so if you like this video then uh, please hit like on the youtube and do let me know if you have any doubts or comments thank you